Hi, welcome to the Healthy You Feel Good Festival. I'm Emma and I'm your instructor for today. And I'm gonna take you through a LIT exercise. So LIT stands for Low Impact Intensity Training. So we're not gonna be jumping, we're gonna still have a lot of sweat and a lot of energy, all right? So I'll take you through a warm up. Then we're gonna go through five exercises and we're gonna repeat them four times, 30 seconds on with a 30 second rest. And then I'll pull you down, all right? So I just want you to start getting the body ready. Let's warm up, so we'll start marching. Now you can either wear bare feet or you can wear um, uh, trainers for this one. It's entirely up to you. Enjoy the sunshine. Good guys. All right, so keep going. We're gonna go eight more. Good, start getting those arms moving. We're gonna take it to a side step. So we'll take it down tap. Now making sure you're bending those knees, breathing and pressing down into those heels. We wanna get those legs ready. Good. Let's start feeling good. Press, now let's press those arms back, warming up those shoulders. We're gonna go eight counts. Lovely guys, so I really want you to enjoy this. So, hamstring curls and pull through. Your movement, your body. So if you don't feel comfortable doing certain things, then just don't do them. I'm gonna offer you modifications throughout, but let's just start moving that body. We're gonna take the heel forward, step, press. Really warming up the backs of those legs. Good. We're gonna take it marching again and march through, energy up. We're gonna take a knee lift in four, three, right knee, go right to left, warming up those hip flexors. Now point your toes, really activate those leg muscles. Arms press, up and press. Good guys, keep moving. We've got eight more here. Eight. Four, good. We're gonna kick and punch out. So we extend out and punch, warming up those hamstrings. Lovely guys, so you should start feeling that heartbeat start raising. We should start getting a little bit warmer. Press, we're gonna take it back to that side. In four, three, two, we'll take down, press, arms, plie, down. Good, you're gonna punch to the corner for me. We're down and punch. Now drop that chest and lift up. We're down, we're down. Good, arm over the top and stretch your waist. Lovely guys, keep moving. We've got eight more counts. Eight. We're four. Good, we're gonna take it back to that hamstring curl. So pull through for me, pull. We're four. Lovely, back to the knees. We'll go left knee and press. And up, energy pressing. We're four. Good, marching and march and press. Good, so we're gonna incorporate some of the moves now. We're gonna take it back into a lunge. Now I want you to think about your hips square and your shoulders square. Back heel high and press, weight down, all right? Now if this is tricky on those knees or toes, then just don't, don't take the, um, the heel off. So roll through, so we're just moving through. We're down and press, we're down and press. We're down, keep it moving, we'll go four. With three, with two, last one, and march again, march. Good, moving those legs, and move those knees, we're at eight. Seven, with four. Good, we're gonna take it back to that punch, to the corner, let's go, down, punch. Really lengthen through that toe, lengthen through the arm, and punch, good. Now, we'll go down, tap, down and tap. Drop the chest and I want you to now really lift through that core. We tap. All right, so we're nearly there guys. So the first exercise is we're gonna chasse. All right, so the movement is chasse, kick. Chasse, kick. Now, making sure that we're extending through the thigh and lifting through the tummy. 
and pushing out through that heel. I'm going to layer it, so if you want to add more, then you can, but if you want to stay where we are, entirely up to you. Remember, it's your workout, and this is all about feeling good for you and healthy. All right? Good. We've got 10 seconds. Whew. Shoulders down. Plie, bend those knees. Shuffle. We'll go. Shuffle and push. One, two, and. Good. So remember, if you don't want to take it fast, we just step out. One, two, one, out. Or if you want more, let's get those arms moving. Press. One, two. Press. One, two. One, two. Good, guys. Keep moving. Energy out through that heel. Out. Bend your knee. One, two, three, two. Finish it for me. And done. Good, guys. Your second exercise is we're going to take it into a back lunge and punch. All right. Now, exactly like the warm up, I want you to concentrate on keeping those hips square. And you're going to punch, punch, step back. One, two, step back. If it affects your knees or your toes, we want to be here and squeeze your bum to press. One, two. Ready? Let's go. Going one, one, two, and one, two. If you want more of this, you can add weights. You can add that resistance, but I want you to think about that front knee really nice and grounded. One, two, and one, two, and good guys. One, two. Breathe, working into that core. Use the breath and press, press, back heel high. One, two, three, finish it for me, and, and done. Good guys, all right. Now, we're gonna come out to the floor. If you do not want to go to the floor, you can use a prop, you can use a chair, and you can stay up. To the floor, we're gonna come down, we're gonna press, you're gonna lift your knee for two, and then you're gonna push back up and push into your heels. Or, you're here, knee, knee, press back, and squeeze. Exactly the same. Let's go for it, ready? One, two, knee, knee. Making sure you're pushing into your heels, into your bum, and squeeze. We'll go. Out, out. One, two. Each time, making sure we're centering. Breathe. Tummy's strong, or we're here. Here, one, two. Press back, squeeze, lift. All right, one, two. Last one, and done. Good, guys. Whew. All right. So, we've got a squat. Now, making sure our feet are outside hip width, we're opening up those toes just to find that engagement. So from here, you tilt from that pelvis, and I want you to kick to the side. So we kick. You've got to make sure that you're pushing on the outside of your foot, otherwise we're gonna fall into those knees. All right, nice and strong through that position. Ready, squat, find it, kick it, one. Now we want to make sure we're centering that pelvis before we're moving. Push back, kick through the heel and tilt away. And press. Just checking those knees aren't falling in. Press back to kick out. Press back and kick. And kick. So if you notice my position, I'm always low and down and press. One and press. Last one for me. And done. Good. All right. So, the last exercise in the series, and then we're going to repeat them again. We've got a knee driver. Now, we want to tilt from that pelvis, and we want to drive into the front of the back leg. The back of the front leg. All right, so we go one, two, three, change, and. One, two, three, and change. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, and change. One, two, three, and change. So notice, I'm really moving, adjusting my feet. Good, one, two, one, two, three. Again, if you want more, you can add weights to this. It's entirely up to you. Two, go and go in. One, two, three, again, and one, two, three. Last one for me, go. One, two, three, 
and rest, good. All right, we've got it all again. Okay. So, first exercise is a chasse and kick forward. Chasse and kick forward. Remember your modifications. Step, or if you want more, you're lifting those arms above your head. All right. Healthy you, feel good festival. Ready, go, chasse. One, two, one, two, out. One, two, one, two. Woo. Really extending. Thinking core and press out. One, two, or we're here. One, two, one, two, out. Good, you've got seven seconds. You're so nearly there, guys. Keep moving. One, two, out, press, and you are done. Whew. Good. All right. Back lunge into that punch. So remember your modifications. If you do have um, sore feet or issues with your toes and this position just doesn't work, then keep your heel down. Try and bend as much as you can and keep your core engaged, all right? Making sure you're stepping the foot to the side. Let's go, ready, and one, one, two. Press, one, two, press. Press. Now breathe. Let's help our core engage. Now really ground yourself. Find it, then punch. We're one. We're one. If you want to slow it down, slow it down. Good. Keep going. Open up that front knee and breathe. Two, and you're done. Good, guys. All right. Whew. This warmer weather is... Uh, Starting to get hot. All right, so we're going to take it out into that plank. Remember, you're, um, you can either come to the floor or you can take it up either onto a chair or a work surface, whatever works for you. All right, you ready for it? We've got eight seconds. Three, two, ready, let's go. We press out, find that plank position, knees draw in using your core. Press the heels, then squeeze the thighs and bum as you lift. One, two. One, two. Press. Nice and strong. We're not going to do many of these. Thinking technical rather than speed. We press. Strong, strong. One, two. And press and squeeze. We've got one more. Go. One, two. Press, press. And done. <laughs> Good, guys. All right. So we've got that squat into that side kick. So think of yourself as karate, all right? We are tilting from the pelvis. Our feet are outside hip width and they're slightly open to really feel that engagement through the glutes. We tilt the pelvis and the shoulders come with us. We press, kick, all right, ready? Let's go and we'll go one, kick. So I'm constantly thinking about pressing into my heels to allow that bum, to allow that hamstring to work, lengthening through into my waist. Press, strong, strong. Good guys, nearly there. One, two, and out. We're one, two, and out. Woo. One, two, one, two, one, and you're done. Good, all right. We've got it into that knee driver. All right, so again, remembering from our pelvis, we tilt and the shoulders want to come with us. So rather than rounding our shoulders and our tucking our tail, we want to think about lengthening and engaging our tummy to protect that lower back. All right, so four seconds. Let's lunge, ready, and we'll go one, two, three, change, and one, two, three, tap, tap. Really adjusting those feet, make a big deal of it. We're one, two, three, tap, tap, and go in one, two, three, over, over, and you're one, two, really from that core, over, go in one, two, three, over, good, one, two, three, over, and release, good guys. 
all again. Now, we're gonna repeat them two more times, all right? So, if you need a drink, if you need to take a breath, take a breath. Remember, if you wanna add more, add more, add more resistance, try and get lower in those legs. But remember, it's all about feeling good and moving that body. All right, we've got 10 seconds. First exercise, chasse, kick, all right? And going, going, one, and kick, one. One, one. If we want more, you can lift those arms above the head. One, two, big weight, push through the heel. One, two, four, we're here. One, two, three, one, two, three. Moving the body, it's better than not moving the body. So, press it, last one, and release. Good, guys. All right, back lunge into those punches. <sighs> Remember your modification. If the knees are, are affected or feeling sore, then do not go down too low. Think about engaging the thighs and the glutes and press, all right? and keeping those legs nice and strong and the hips strong. All right, let's go. Ready, back lunge. One, one, two, and step. One, two. Now ensure that your front knee isn't waving or coming in. So really establishing that position. One, two, and, and, one, two, and, and. Good, guys. One, two, and, one, two. Keep going, one, two. 10 seconds, one, two. Woo. One, two, nearly there. One, two, press, nice and aggressive. Go, last one, and done. Good, all right. So, out into that plank. Remember, we can either use a chair, or you can stay here if you wish to. Staying up, it's entirely up to you. Good, you've got 10 seconds. I like to move between. All right, five, four, three, two, ready, go! Squeeze, making sure we're finding our tummy muscles, we're pressing, we're pushing, or we're up, knee, knee, press, lift, one, press, up, up, all right, nearly there guys. Remember, it's not about how many you're doing, it's about technique and you are done. Good guys. All right, nearly there. Whew. Squat into that. Nice karate kick. Remember your position, outside hip width, toes open to find your glutes, pressing back into that bottom, making sure we're not tucking. All right, press. Strong tummy. Ready, five. Right leg. One, kick. Now I'm really making sure that as I kick, I'm pushing onto the outside of my foot. Because what we don't want to do is roll into our knee and into that ankle. We want nice, strong ankles right up into that pelvis. So the whole of that leg is working. We'll go one, press. One, press. Out, down, press, bum, back, one. Last one, one, and done. Good guys, knee driver. Now notice I just, I take both hands together. So I'm really, I'm using my arms for resistance because all of this workout is using our own body weight. So really think about how can I add more? Pushing those hands, finding those core muscles by pushing against them. All right, right leg. Arms, tilt, strong tummy, ready, and go in one, two, three, and go one, two, three. Make a big point of stepping. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Press, press, one, two, three. One, two, three. Even the simplest of movements can become tricky. All right, let's go. Last one, two, three, and done, good. 
We've got this one more time, guys, and then I'm gonna cool you down, all right? Okay, now, how can you make it that little bit bigger, that little bit more? Can we stay a little bit lower? All right, eight seconds. Chasse, kick. Three, two, one. One, two, three. One, two, three. Same thing here. Still thinking about the placement of that foot. Really, really important. Press. One, two. One, two. One, two. Remember your options if you're here. It doesn't matter. If you've got weight, it doesn't matter. Press, last one, and release. Good, guys. All right, back lunge into those punches. Okay. So remember your options again. Really important. Because we want to be inclusive, so we don't want to scare you away. We want to enjoy the exercise. And there's so many modifications. All right, so just take it to the side just so you can check. Hip square, shoulder square. All right, as we step back, press center, and one, two, and, and, go. One, two, press, press. Now I find that breathing really helps me connect my core muscles. One, two, good guys. You're halfway through. Breathe out. Good. Nice and dramatic. One, two. <laughs> One, two. Good. Five. Strong front knee. Press through that heel and you are done. Good. Whew. All right. So into that plank with those knee, knee. Nice deep breath. Okay, 10 seconds. Again, if you need to break and have drinks between, then do so. Make sure you are staying hydrated. We've got three seconds. Ready? We want to press back into the heels before we go out. We take the knee, ensuring we're engaging our bum. Press the heels down to squeeze up. All right. Remember your options. We're on the floor or we're on the incline. Left, press, squeeze, and one, knee, Knee, really thinking about that long neck and press. One, two, we're so nearly there, guys. This is your last one. One, two. <laughs> Good. All right, we've got that squat with that kick to the side. Really thinking about your hips, your waist here. All right, 10 seconds. Let's find that good, strong technique. Hip width apart, toes open, press back. Let's find it. Press, strong tummies. We'll go one, kick, one, kick. And make sure the knees don't fall in. We want to press back, slow it down, find the back of your leg. Press, squeeze, press. If you want to add a punch, out. It's your workout. Enjoy it. You've got 10 seconds. Out and through. Out and through. Good. Reckon two more. Now your last one and press it out. Good, guys. We're done with that one. <laughs> Take a rest. Okay, so we've got a knee driver pressing in. Remember now, staying low. Press down to that front heel. Drive in to the core without using your back hands, use that pressure. All right, ready. Five seconds. Tilt, strong tummies. Ready, we'll go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Two, three. Up, up, and a one, two, three. Now, if you feel confident enough to keep going with this, you can. Just keep going. Two, and then you can. Kind of jump between it, one, but not jump off the floor. So it's a bit of a one, two, three, hop, hop, one, two, three. Keep going, last one, two, three, 
and done. Guys, we are done. How amazing, how amazing. So I'm gonna cool you down now. So just making sure that you've got space Take it into a nice wide, wide stance, shoulders down, hands to hips. I want you to make space between your rib, your hips, and I want you to lengthen through the spine. And from here, we're lifting up out of our ribs, out of our waist, breathe. Good guys, feel that lengthening through the back, through the side, and up through the front. Good. Coming back to centre, plie again, and lift. Again, one more time, shoulders up, and we're pulling up out of that waist. Good, guys, and plie. Now, rotating towards your right leg. We're just going to take it down. We're going to drop our heel, and I want you to think about lengthening away from that heel, really, using your thigh as the um, stable leg working through the anchor and press, lengthen. Good. Then we want to open out, opening out and stretching into that groin. Now, if you need a chair or something to hold on to so you're not going as deep, absolutely fine. Stretching is all about your ability and stretching into, into your body how you feel comfortable, all right? Not pushing it too much. Good, really feeling that stretch into the inner thighs, into the groin area, and then rolling other side. The heel goes down, we use the front thigh and lean. Good guys, coming back up. Now, working into the front of the leg, I'm just gonna use a prop to help me. Squeezing the bum, pressing the pelvis forward, finding your hip flexor, and then stretching all the way down. Again, if this is tricky on your knee, you can just take the foot back, take the heel slightly off, and think about squeezing the buttock and finding that stretch and lifting up the chest. Finding that stretch. All right. Good. Lovely. Changing legs. Finding that balance. Squeeze the bum, press forward. Woo and find that hip all the way down to that knee. Good, lovely. So taking it up to the side, again, wanting to think about making space between the rib, the hips, all of those beautiful organs that we're supporting, lifting, stretching. Good. Taking it into a parallel position, feet, hands press, push the palms forward, and I want you to really tuck your tail, really tuck it under, squeeze the bum, and feel that stretch all the way down the spine, all the way into the shoulders, and I want you to make the stretch your own. Whatever needs to be stretched, pressing back, making room for those hips, shoulders. Good, coming back to centre roll. And last of all, the head. Stretching the neck. Nice heavy arms. Good guys. Woo. Lovely, coming back here. So we wanna lift up, take those hands. One final time, stretching. Good, moving the legs out. Good. Lovely. I want to thank you so, so much for joining me today. Thank you. Again, my name's Emma, and we have gone through a low impact interval training. All right. You absolutely smashed it, and thank you so, so much for joining me.